left-handed overhand, right-hand underhand. Let me demonstrate it. So what you're doing is you're taking this four-petal anti-spin flower and this zero-petal flower, and you're cutting off the top and throwing it away. So we're just doing the bottom, and we're doing that with both hands so that it will come out looking like this. And on fire, this looks like a heart. I'll see if I can find you a picture later and send it so that you can get a sense of what it looks like in performance. If we start in the front position, in underhand, we're gonna go from the front, pop it down in anti-spin and then back, and then swing it around to the front. So down and back and swing front, down and back, swing front, down and back, swing front. And when you go back, remember to let it, so if you watch me at the point where it's right down here and I pop it back, notice how long I wait, right? I'm, I'm really trying to let it pop all the way back so that I'm getting the full range of motion. You want a big cap. And down and back and swing, down and back and swing. And try and connect it directly together now. So down and back, swing front, down and back, swing front, down and back, swing front, down and back, swing front. So you, as you pass six o'clock, you open your palm to the side. And as it opens to the side, you let the poi, so you're here, the poi is on this part of the turn. You let it come up over the top while your hand's out there, and then you swing it around this way. So you want to pop it up and back and swing, up and back and swing. So you really want your arm to go just a touch higher in the back. For your left hand, if we start here in the back position, you're going to do anti-spin. So you pop it down, front, swing to the back, 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 down, front, swing to the back. And as you go to the front, remember not to chase it, right? You don't want to lean forward. You want to stay upright. You can shift your weight to your heels by lifting your toes, which will help keep you vertical as you're doing this motion. Um, so it's underhand. We're going to come from the front. And here we go. Five, six, seven, eight. Down and back, swing front, down, back, swing. Down, back, swing, and down, back, swing. Down, back, swing. Down, back, swing. Down, back, swing. And down, back, swing. And down, back, swing. And down, back, swing. And down, back, swing. Down, back, swing. So do the drill to even it out and make sure that you're swinging both sides. And if we start with what we just had, where the right's in front and the left's in back, all you do is swing across the bottom. Actually, this is the anti-spin. So down, back, and then swing. Down and back, and then swing. Down, back, and swing. Down and back, and swing. So there's this whole hip opening thing that you have to make sure that you're doing. So down and back, swing. Down and back, swing. Down and back, swing. Down and back, swing. Right is under, left is over. We're opening our hips to the right side. Left is in the front, left is in the front position, right is in the back. We're gonna start with the easy one. And then we're gonna swing and just do the in-spin to change positions. Now your right is in the front, your left is in back, your hip is open to the left, you're still in the same time. Then you're gonna come down to here, and then you're gonna anti-spin back to the place where we started, where the left goes to the front and the right goes to the back. Then we do a big swing, so change position, right and front, left and back. And then let's try the anti-spin in one motion, five, six, seven, and down and back. And swing, and down and back 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 and swing. Now, if you're struggling to get it together, or you feel like you're losing it, or you feel like you're losing your timing, here's what I recommend. Stop, swing, down and back. Stop, reset, swing, down and back, stop, reset, swing, down and back, stop, reset. And keep doing that until you can do one where you don't feel like you're losing your timing or losing your plank. So let's start with the left in front and overhand, the right and back and underhand. 
And what we'll do is we'll do one repetition where we swing, then anti-spin, then hold, six, seven, eight. Swing, anti-spin, hold, six, seven, eight. Swing, anti-spin, hold, six, seven, eight. Swing, anti-spin, hold, six, seven, eight. And five, and hold, six, seven, eight. Six, and hold, six, seven, eight. Seven, and hold, six, seven, eight. Eight, and hold, six, seven, eight. Nine, and hold, six, seven, eight. And 10, and hold, now we're going to switch from here, switch to the other position. So if your right hand's in front, left hand's in back, we're going to do the same thing starting from here. So five, six, seven, eight. Anti spin, swing, hold five, six, seven, eight. Anti spin, swing, 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 five, six, seven, eight. Anti spin swing, five, six, seven, eight. Anti spin swing and seven, six, seven, eight. Anti spin and eight, three, four, and swing. And nine, two, three, four. Anti spin swing and 10. And here we go and anti spin and done.